Russia's Foreign Minister Sergei Lavrov is meeting his Iranian counterpart Hossein Amir Abdullahi in, in Moscow. The nuclear deal between Iran and the West is likely to be on the agenda. They're also expected to discuss Syria, Afghanistan, Ukraine and issues related to the Caspian Sea region. Let's go to Moscow and speak to journalist Yulia Shapovalova. And uh, what do Russians want from this meeting? Well, actually, the meeting is still underway, and uh, we are waiting for uh, the news conference any moment, and we'll be able to hear from both ministers and uh, from their delegation members uh, what's been discussed. And uh, we know that the delegations also discussed the Iranian... Uh, we're going to discuss the Iranian nuclear program in terms of the Joint Comprehensive Plan of Actions, as well as the state of affairs in various countries of the Caucasus and Caspian regions. Uh, so the Russian-Iranian cooperation is growing, of course, and it is quite obvious as both countries are sanctioned by other states. But believe it or not, if you get to the streets of Russian cities and ask people who is a friend of Russia nowadays, the people will answer you, it is Iran. So many things are going on on a daily basis between mm. the two countries here, like economy, energy, tourism, etc. Russia has always been Tehran's ally, supporting it for years. So nowadays, the uh, trade turnover is growing, and this is something everyone here endorses. So the relations are developing and Russia's relatively quickly finding a way to overcome its isolation and other problems caused by sanctions. OK, thank you so much for the update. That is Yulia Shapovalova for us in Moscow. Well, we're going to go to Ali Hashim, who joins us from Tehran. And Iran and Russia seem to be coordinating closely on many, many different issues. What's the view from Tehran? Well, to Tehran, Russia is uh, one of the main allies right now. At, at, let's say one of the countries that Iran is having uh, very good relations with. Uh, there is a lot of intersections with respect to interests. So uh, maybe China, Russia, these are the main uh, uh, partners of, of Iran, mainly after the, uh, the sanctions. Iran is looking forward to get out to overcome the isolation uh, after the sanctions. And, and now, with Russia under sanctions, both countries are able to cooperate in different ways. If we go back a few months ago, President Raisi, the president of Iran, visited, uh, visited Russia. President Putin was here also a few months ago. So this is an ongoing operation between the two countries and on different layers, economically, uh, uh, energy-wise, uh, politically, and also on the diplomatic side, especially with uh, Russia being part of the 5 plus 1 previously and 4 plus 1 now, the partners of Iran in the nuclear deal. Mm. So to Iran, it's uh, really a priority to uh, be uh, in full coordination with Russia and to go maybe a step forward towards signing a strategic alliance or a partnership, which is something that Russian and Iranian officials are expected to uh, talk about. OK, thank you so much. That's Ali Hashim for us in Tehran.